Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are talking about Alexander Romanov versus Rodrigo Nascimento. Now, Alexander Romanov, 17 and 3. I believe he was 16 and 0. Yeah, against yeah. Chase Sherman was his 16th victory without a loss. Beat the shit out of Marcy Tybor in that first round. Ran out of gas, lost the majority of the decision. Then got Volkov down to the ground. Volkov grabbed the cage, which initially stopped the takedown. And it was kind of all over from there. It was weird, man. Got a big victory over Blagloy, Ivanov. Very weird fight. And then lost against Shelton Almeida. Weird naked choke. Again, very weird because he's very good on the ground. Don't really understand it. He's been coming in super heavy in his last four fights, I would say. I guess the Marcin Tabora one, I think he was uh, lower, but the last three. I mean, because, like, the Chase Sherman uh, victory, he was in great shape. Plus 110, basically even, 33 years old, 6'2", 75-inch reach. Now, Rodrigo Nascimento, what in the world are we doing here? Get this thing out of here. Rodrigo Nascimento, 11-2, he's 3-1. 0 oh, in 1. He's a minus 135 favorite. 31 years old. 6'2 with an 80 inch reach. Same height with a 5 inch reach. His last loss was Derek Lewis five months ago. He was flatlined. It was awesome to see. The, the biggest issue with this fight is I think Nascimento movement wise is better on, on, the, on the feet. Just how he moves. He flows a little bit better. He's not a good striker. Six wins by submission. I just, I don't see him finishing, submitting Alexander Romanov. I know Jelton Almeida, who is good, by the way, um, fit, it was finished by uh, Almeida. He also had, he's 6-3 and three in the UFC. He has three submissions of his own in the UFC. One TKO, which, boy, who was that? Oh, Jared Vandera. That's who that was, okay. Um, but yeah, I, I, I really like Alexander Romanov in this one. It could be ugly. It could be a weird, sloppy fight. Yeah, I, I like uh, Nascimento in this one. Uh, not Nascimento, Jesus. I like uh, Romanov to beat Nascimento. Again, it's going to be weird. It's not going to be pretty. It's probably not going to be fun to watch. But I think Romanov gets the job done. If he comes in in, de in any kind of a decent shape, I think he destroys Nascimento. As always, guys. Subscribe, like, comment. Let me know who you're picking. Peace.